Yeah, KD3 obviously had some nerves going on here. the brothers the brothers smash and bark knows so dark knows this matchup very well but just as well as dark knows that bark knows it so honestly it's it's not really them playing the matchup it's more per se of them playing each other because they know each other so well so so these can be interesting these can be slaughters uh, you know it's just about who's playing the other opponent better. Yeah. It's not nearly their matchups. What is it, Sam? Mm. How have they been recently? Uh, uh, have you seen them in uh, brackets at Dark House? Uh, I mean, Bark usually takes it. I mean, it, it happens when you have to work less with, because your character is just more easy to get kills with. And Those by how many second chances Pikachu gets with his up B. Yeah, that's Falcon true. doesn't get any second chances. Pikachu gets like 15 chances in one life. Yes, that was really nice by Dark. Like I said, Dark Wheel knows this fortune. matchup just as well, so. Yeah, Star King, I completely agree with you. KD3, like, when he's when he has no nerves, he is extremely good. Like, I was playing him all last night for probably like four hours, and yeah, he was wrecking me. He's one of the top PA players. Yeah. Top three. Him, Hammer, Heart, Finio. It's hard to rank them at this point. They all just take games off each other. KD3 knows how to have a good time. Upbeat. Oh, up four smash. Nice. I like that. So Dark is looking pretty strong, but then he goes and does that. All right. He got his 15% he needed that. True. Actually, I feel like he doesn't want that. I feel like he just wants to zero to death keep it. It's hard to play when you're on your last stock against the Peach. Oh, oh my god, the tech, and he pissed it all away. Oh. Ah, oh, okay, he didn't piss it all away. All right, see you, KD3. Happy birthday, dude. Dude, KD, see you. You're awesome today, man. Um, so I'm probably going with GT because I, I got to go back to Baltimore. Unless Raz wants to come to Baltimore tomorrow for the weekly or whatever. But he can't because he has football or something. Alright, see you, KD. Safe travels, alright? Don't party too hardy. Wow. Down smash! Down smash! Just barely missed it. That thing is so big if you look at it in hitbox mode, like I don't I can't believe it missed. That's that's just not right. I love the sickly blue jigglypuff with that 19 x Yeah, Aquaberry, Aquaberry Jigglypuff. Aquaberry? Aquaberry. When she gets zapped, she turns like back to normal pink though. Did you see that? Or just hit in general. <laughs> No way, you're yeah, right, plus. that's so weird. That's got me tripping out now. Usually I notice the weird stuff like that. I also like a, a cream puff. There's a cream puff. Like a, cream, a cream color puff on the Everdrive. It's like cream. Is that the one where it's just like, not her face, but part of her body? That is Burn Victim Jigglypuff. <laughs> uh, there's also Burn Victim Pikachu. But no, there's literally just oh, like a man. cream color of Jigglypuff. 
Um, I'll have to look when I get home. Yeah, they need to make more skins for the Ember Drive. Absolutely. Like I want, I want a, a wolf outfit. I want a Raichu hat, a Raichu outfit for Pikachu. Uh, give me, give me a socks. Like, like have it be Fox, but like he's just wearing socks and you call him Socks. <laughs> and then I want, I want a Ganon skin for my Falcon. Yeah. Purple fire. Uh, what else? I'm trying to think. I want a rainbow shine. I want bright green lasers with Fox. You and the lot. most, other than costumes, like costumes aren't important. The thing what we need on the EverDrive is hit stun mode. It's like when you hit somebody, they turn white or a different color until the hit stun wears off and then they go back to normal. Like that would improve, I think, a lot of people's gameplay if they could see the hit stun in the game. Huh. You're, yeah, you're definitely right. Cause I, I think hitbox is like staring at the hitbox in the game helped dramatically, and I think hit stun would be uh, eye opener too. And we've but come down to the wire, and I'm surprised because uh, the matchup for uh, for uh, for Jigglypuff is not that great because Pikachu's back air and up air just really outspace oh, all the things. Yellow rest. And it's really hard for Jiggly to win neutral, and that's it. No that's more it. jumps. So, Bark making it 1 1. The brothers are even. Taco's just like, let me let this get over so I can I can play my match. <laughs> I'm tired. I want I want my money. I want to go eat. Everybody in the Smash 64 community is so nice. Oh, the zip zap. So if you're just looking for a nice group of people, you know, just just go to the corner where the 64 kids are hanging out because they're, they're, they're cool. Oh, that neutral air was brutal. Down, Down smash. smash. There it is. Uh, I'm a little surprised uh, Dark Horse didn't switch back to Falcon. I think he believes in his uh, Jigglypuff because he believes in his combos, but uh, like I said, it's super hard to win neutral, so I uh, really, I, like I said, I think it, like, uh, in my mind, like, yeah, why wouldn't he go Falcon again? Because uh, this is a really tough matchup for Jiggly. Nice DI from Bart. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Yeah. Little does he know that bracket can reset and it could be three or two oh. more seconds. <laughs> <laughs> it's like crossing his is, fingers. Is Come he on, in a hurry to leave? Losers get is out he of in a hurry for us to get out of here? They, of course. They want to go home. Okay. Oh, they want the stream now? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. It's been a long day of Smash here in New Jersey. Reverse bear. I don't yeah, know if you wanted a reverse going bear. Going on 24 hours now of straight no sleep, only Smash. For you? Yeah. Okay, so me and you, you know the laboratory? Yeah, that's where I play. Yeah, me and Raz showed up there at 9 o'clock last night. Yeah. We played till 6.30 in the morning. Went out to a diner, got breakfast. Went to Raz's house. Played Smash until 10.30 in the morning. Left, came here, and been playing Smash since. That's ridiculous. Last major me and Raz went to, we stayed up all night. And uh, we, we did three 99 stock battles. Oh, my God. And uh, Three? Yeah. Man... <laughs> uh, it, uh, it, we just did a man ditto, and then we did uh, a Pikachu ditto, and then we did uh, Pika Man. Cause I was just working on Pikachu, like I was obsessed with Pikachu for that major. But I hate the little guy, I, I never want to play him again. He has no heart and soul. Uh, yeah, I had to. I was scared. I didn't want to lose first round. And I literally almost did, like you totally outplayed me with Pikachu. Like, I should have stayed Fox. That's the thing, like... If I if I'm not confident and like I get I didn't the time that I was playing on tilt but like 
basically what I'm trying to say is like if my nerves are affected, my fox gets affected so much worse than any of my other characters because they're like so technical. So like I, when I'm under lots of pressure and I'm like shit I don't want to lose, like I'm like maybe I have to play a different character. So Dark Horse is hanging on by the skin of his teeth. Yeah, I honestly thought he was gonna get a nice combo there, but uh, couldn't really, uh, couldn't really get his opening. <sighs> but uh, Dark is certainly not giving this up without a fight. Yeah, he's playing very safe. That's very it. Defensively. Like I said something. The second I say something. Yep. 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 It's just how it goes. What's that, game two? That's game... Uh, uh, that was game three. Yeah, so... But game two for, for Bark. They're staying. One Falcon, one, two, three. Two, one, go! Wow, that was a really crazy back air. What? Oh. What? Did he just pull him out of the thunder? What? <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> he DI'd right into it. Just every single frame. <laughs> <laughs> For every frame, empty eyes. Yeah, he even like switched it up and like started going a different direction back into it. Oh, oh. the town! Did not. But it's not gonna help him. He should have just yellow rested and hoped. There it is, back air, that's it. Bada bing, bada boom, zero death, Pikachu. And that's why I think the matchup is like really tough, and that's what I'm saying, I think the Brody brothers right now, or just like lately, or just in general, since they know each other so well, they play each other. So it's not necessarily the matchup that wins them, like the games, but it's like them playing each other, and I think the matchup plus the experience on the characters is like just not what Dark like wants. I really think he should've gone Falcon, but hopefully he can Heard me wrong. Oh. All right. He's still alive. Oh, okay. <laughs> Pulling him out of that thunder again. Uh, Bark's just playing with his food now, and he may regret that if he keeps doing it. Oh, what a good edge guard. Pikachu, the easiest character to edge guard in the game. Because, uh, you know, it has no hitbox. Now it's three to one. Looking like uh, it's going to be Bark and uh, Tacos for uh, random finales. Wow, those that was are really good. He kept him moving. Yeah, it's, it's not an easy thing to do. To just nooch and keep going right. Just keep nooching. <laughs> I I think I heard uh, Mark Sanchez shout "Do it!" after uh, after Dark got the first down or up air up till up till. Alright, All right. now we got Grand Fizinals. 